welcome to the tutorial problem solving or normalization in this tutorial we'll discuss about how to find a relation using which normal form we'll see with the help of example let's see first example let r be relations with the following functional and dependency b determine c d determine e. find the highest normal form in which the relation r is in right so first we have to find candidate key right we have already discussed how to find candidate key of relation r in week 5 so we will directly return what are the candidate key right in this relation candidate key is bd now we have to find this relation is in first normal form or not what first normal form said all the attributes should have atomic value in the question mention that all the attributes have atomic value right so this relation is in first normal form if it is does not mention all the attributes have atomic value if it is written like that a b c d we assumed that all the attributes are atomic in nature so this relation is in first normal form now we have to check this relation is in second normal form or not what second normal form said first condition is it is in first normal form and second condition is it does not contain any partial dependency what is partial dependency if a determine b a proper subset of candidate key and b set of non prime attribute you can see that b determines c p is a proper subset of candidate key and c is a non prime attribute so this relation contain partial dependency so we can say that this relation not in second order this relation is in first nf right let's see another example let r a b c d f be a relation with the following functional and dependency f this b c d determine e b c e determine f d determine a d e a determine c c a determine e find the highest normal form in which the relation r is in first we have to find the candidate key right in this relation candidate key are b c d and b d e right first we have to check this relation is in first normal form or not in this question mentioned that all the attributes have atomic value right so this is in first normal form now we have to check this relation is in second normal form or not you can see that d e determine a D E is the proper subset of candidate key and A is a set of non prime attribute right. So we can say that this relation contain partial dependency right. So we can say that this relation is in not in second and this relation is in first and right. Now let us see another example. Let R B W X Y Z be a relations with the following functional dependency. B determine W w determine x y z and x determine y find the highest normal form in which the relation r is in first we have to find the candidate key right in this relation candidate key is b right now we have to check this relation is in first normal form or not so you can see that all the attributes have atomic value right so this relation is in first normal form now we have to check this relation is in second normal form or not we have to check partial dependency right b determine w b is a candidate key right not proper subset of candidate key w determine x y z this is not a proper subset of candidate key right x determine y this is not a proper subset of candidate key right so this relation does not contain any partial dependency so we can say that this relation is in second normal form now we have to check a uh, third nf so what third normal form said if a determined b 
यही जे सुपर की और बी प्राइमेट्रिक राइट सो लेट्स चेक दिस रिलेशन इज इन थर्ड नाम और नॉट बी डिटरमाइन डब्ल्यू बी इज ए कैंडिडेट की डब्ल्यू डिटरमाइन एक्स वाई जेड डब्ल्यू नॉट ए सुपर की एंड एक्स वाई जेड ऑल्सो नॉट ए प्राइमेट्रिक दिस रिलेशन नॉट इन थर्ड नॉर्मल फॉर्म दिस रिलेशन इज इन सेकेंड नॉर्मल फॉर्म राइट लेट सी एन अदर एग्जाम्पल लेट आर बी रिलेशंस with the following functional dependency x y determine w z b z determine x first we have to find the candidate key right candidate key are x y and y z right now first we have to uh, find this relation is in first normal form or not we can see that all the attributes have atomic value so this is in first normal form now we have to check this relation is in second normal form or not so we have to check partial dependency right x y determine w z b x y is a candidate key right and z determine x z z proper subset of candidate key but x not a non prime attributes so this relation does not contain any partial dependency right now we have to check this relation is in third normal form or not एक्स वाई इज ए सुपार की जेड नट ए सुपार की बाट एक्स इज ए प्राइम एट्रीब्यूट सो दिस रिलेशन इज इन थार्ड नॉर्मल फॉर्म नाउ वी हैव टू चेक बी सी एन एफ राइट सो व्हाट बी सी एन एफ सेट इफ ए डिटरमाइंड बी ए मास्ट बी सुपार की राइट सो लेट चेक ऑल द फंक्शनल इंडिपेन्डेंसी एक्स वाई जे सुपर की बट जेड नॉट ए सुपर की सो दिस रिलेशन नॉट इन बी सी एन एफ दिस रिलेशन इज इन थर्ड नॉन एफ राइट नाउ लेट सी एन अदर एग्जाम्पल लेट आर ए बी सी डी बी ए रिलेशन उथ द फॉलोइंग फंक्शन एंड डिपेन्डेंसी ए डिटरमाइन बी बी डिटरमाइन सी सी डिटरमाइन डी डी डिटरमाइन ए फाइंड द हाइस्ट नॉर्मल फॉर्म इन इज द रिलेशन आर इज इन सो फर्स्ट यू हैव टू फाइंड द कैंडिडेट की राइट इन दिस रिलेशन कैंडिडेट की आर A, B, C, D, right? So first we have to check this relation is in first normal form or not. We can see that all the attributes have atomic value. So this relation is in first normal form. Now we have to check this relation is in second normal form or not. So we have to check partial dependency, right? A determined B, A is a candidate key, right? B determined C, B also candidate key. C determined D, C also candidate key. D determined A, D also candidate key. Now we have to check. थार्ड नॉर्मल फॉर्म ए ऑल्सो कैंडिडेट की बी ऑल्सो कैंडिडेट की सी ऑल्सो कैंडिडेट की डी ऑल्सो कैंडिडेट की राइट ना यू हैव टू चेक बी सी एन एफ ए इज ए सुपर की बी ऑल्सो सुपर की सी ऑल्सो सुपर की एंड डी ऑल्सो सुपर की राइट सो दिस रिलेशन इज इन बी सी एन एफ थैंक यू एवरी वन थैंक यू फॉर वॉचिंग दिस ट्यूटोरियल